This is Stephanie Flesher and Theresa Ivancic. And of course, they were first and second at the Indy Pro just last weekend with Theresa Ivancic getting the Duke there. She got the first place and Stephanie, of course, landed in second. I thought it my duty to at least do a comparison between these two, considering uh, it was a qualifier, Olympia qualifier. So Theresa is headed for the Olympia. Now, I really like the physique, taking nothing away from Ivanic. I really like uh, Flesher's physique. Stephanie is fantastic. Look at that flow. Look at that flow. But keep in mind, this is the open class. So they're looking for maybe a little bit more muscle, which, when you really look, does Theresa have more muscle in the arms, things of that nature? Some good separation there, I do believe. These girls are close to being the same height, but it's funny, they... They stand differently in the poses, and for the most part, Stephanie ends up looking taller and maybe more aesthetically pleasing. I mean, look at that tiny wee waistline. That would rival some of the men's classic physique division competitors. But keep in mind, this is not a uh, physique for women, but there is a physique. Uh, there, There's a, a whole bunch of women's divisions at the New York Pro this weekend, and women's physique is one of them. I will be doing a prediction list on the women's physique for the New York Pro, by the way, by the way. Go through these shots. Now, Fred Latsbrit here. When you look at the, the the thin skin, the things of that nature, the muscle separation of Theresa, I can understand her getting the Duke. And you can understand that these women stand at different heights. Look. Look, Stephanie is going tippy-toe. He used to have a crush on a girl named Stephanie in high school. In high school. She was a blonde-haired beauty just like Stephanie here. Wow. If you're listening, St she wouldn't be listening. Oh my goodness. Probably has ten kids by now. That girl that I used to have a crush on. Anyway, anyway, anyway. Where was I with this? Yes, both of these women. And again, much like the front double. Personally, I just like that. I don't know, more more leaner, aesthetically pleasing look that Stephanie brings, but make no mistake about it. Theresa is right there with her, so it's a very close competition all the way around, and that goes with the muscularity as well. Side chest development is like the same thing here. You have a full, big, round delt, and bicep, of course, tricep. Stephanie features vascularities, baby, proper. but then you look at Theresa, maybe not as big, that delt, but look how rip and strided it is, ripped like a strided glute, who cares about straw glutes, but anyway, anyway, you can see what I'm saying, shing, it's a close competition between these two young women, maybe more separation in the wheel of Theresa, now go to the side tricep, you can see what I mean by aesthetics here. Look at uh, the way Stephanie hits these shots. She goes tippy-toe for, you know, the front shots, things of that nature, and she goes totally front for the side uh, tricep. And if you're going to judge it, you're probably going to end up giving it to Theresa. But if, if you do not like this one of Stephanie, Stephanie has then this one. You see what I'm saying now? Now Stephanie appears to be a little more, you know. But this is the ladies' hoo-ha pose position. Like a male pose, the hoo-ha pose. This is the female hoo-ha. And I have to say, the female hoo-ha is kind of nicer than the male hoo-ha. I, I gotta say. Anyway, anyway, where are we going with this one today, ladies and gentlemen? This is Women Only Wednesday. We have to be respectful. These women deserve respect. I see some very... This is the, the first of the two back shots. I see some very disrespectful comments. Some of you guys... You guys, you know who I'm talking about. I mean, why even click on the video and watch it if you're not into female bodybuilding? If you're not into it, I'm not into race car driving. So I'm not going to click on these race car driving, you know, YouTubes and say, this is stupid, this is stupid. I keep it to myself. And I probably just lost some uh, some fans there. Lee Priest likes uh, race car driving. Hey, let's get back on track here. The back of Stephanie... I actually prefer. She's standing up nice and tall, like a lot of these shots. Which is maybe not what they're looking for in the open class. You can see some more thick 
meet in the lower Latin Sertian area of Ther- Theresa. Is it Theresa or Theresa? Teresa? Teresa? Could be either one, but I apologize to her personally. Nobody likes to get their name mispronounced, but either way. Rear double. Ooh, my soul, guys. This one may have been just written off by everybody, like, you know, of course, Theresa won, but look at this back shot from Stephanie. Look at the hard, greeny nature of those traps. Nice uh, aesthetic flow here for Ivancic. This time from the back shot looks fantastic. Look at that. Nice, 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 but man, oh man, condition-wise, very close. Glutes, I would say, hamstrings, maybe an edge to Theresa, but still, guys, this is a close matchup. And you finish off with the abs and thigh, and I'm starting to think, personally, I kind of liked Stephanie's physique a little bit better, but there were certain shots, certain shots that perhaps Stephanie would have been more suited to, of course, an open class win. And this was the open class. So I feel that she did deserve her win. But maybe if you were judging it like a physique competition, the women's physique, maybe Stephanie would have got an edge and she would have won. But anyway, guys, girls, very close competition. And uh, yeah, Theresa won. Hit thumbs up on the video. Subscribe to this. <laughs> sub, sub, sub. Have a great day.